Hello and welcome to Flexibility Learning Channel. In this video, we will discuss about the parts of computer system. We will learn about the following parts. Hardware Software Data User In this video, we will also learn about the sub-components of computer which come in these parts. So let's get started. First of all we will study about hardware. Hardware refers to the physical components of a computer system. These components include Central Processing Unit CPU. The CPU is the brain of the computer and is responsible for executing instructions and performing calculations. Memory RAM. RAM, random access memory, is used to temporarily store data and program instructions that the CPU needs to access quickly. Storage devices. These include hard drives, HDDs, solid state drives, SSDs, and other media used for long term data storage. Input devices. These devices allow users to input data into the computer. Examples include keyboards, mice, touchscreens, and microphones. Hardware also include output devices. These devices display or provide information to the user. Examples include monitors, speakers, and printers. Motherboard The motherboard is the main circuit board that connects and integrates all the hardware components of a computer. Graphics Processing Unit GPU. The GPU is responsible for rendering graphics and is often used for tasks like gaming and video editing. Next part of computer which we will study is Software Software consists of programs, applications, and data that instruct and control the hardware components. It can be categorized into two main types. System software This includes the operating system e.g. Windows, macOS, Linux, and utility programs that manage and control the computer's hardware resources and provide a platform for other software to run. Application Software These are programs designed for specific tasks or functions, such as word processors, web browsers, video games, and productivity software. Next part of computer system is Data Data refers to the information that computers process, store, and manipulate. It can take various forms, including text, numbers, images, videos, and more. Data can be categorized into the following parts. Input data. Data entered into the computer through input devices. Output data. Data generated as a result of computer processing and displayed or printed for the user. Stored data. Data saved on storage devices for future use. Processed data. Data that has been manipulated or transformed by the computer's software and hardware. Last part of computer system is User As user is not a physical part of computer, but without user, the computer cannot function. It is user who give command to computer to function properly. The user is a human or an entity that interacts with the computer system to perform tasks, access information, or run programs. Users provide input to the computer, receive output from it, and interact with software applications. Users can range from individuals using personal computers to organizations using complex networked systems with multiple users. So this was all about parts of computer system. In this video, we have covered the four major parts of computer system, as well as their subdivisions. If you want to learn more about computers, then you should visit our playlist of Introduction to Computers. All the important and basic things about computer are discussed there. Also by watching those videos, you can become expert in computer. Thanks for watching this video. If this video was helpful, do like and subscribe this channel for future learning.